Looking back over those five years, I really considered what I had found, what had changed. The first profound change was that all of the students were much more engaged in reading. In the beginning, they were totally reluctant readers, not interested in trying, and would avoid it at any cost. By the end of the five years, they were readers, seeking out books to read, and they would have engaging discussions about books. The students became more analytical. Whether it was attention to detail in the art or decoding text, they would focus on details in a way they hadn't before. All the students had grasped the concept of metaphor. With a previous group of deaf and hard of hearing students, with a reading level of grade five, I had tried to teach the concept of metaphor and they never really understood, though they tried. However, by the end of the five years, this group skillfully could identify metaphoric language when presented to them. They were now able to identify how often it comes up in their environment. In the beginning, they were rigid in their thinking, unable to problem solve in some instances. But through the art activities, their thinking became more flexible. They were able to identify multiple options for solving problems. Their reading skills noticeably improved. They were able to break through that plateau they had been previously stuck at. I would say that they were reading at two or three grades higher. Their writing skills noticeably improved. Both grammar and structure improves so that their writing was easily understandable. A number of students started their own art practice at home. The students started taking on more challenging assignments in art, reading and writing, and academic knowledge. I also noticed that they took on more personal and communal responsibilities. 